All right, everyone, what's up? Today we're gonna do some metal art. I got a piece of quarter inch stainless steel plate and it's cut in an oval shape. I'm gonna try and transfer a drawing that I did in my sketchbook a couple months ago. I'm gonna stencil it out. We'll start welding on it. We'll do some painting, who knows what else, but we'll figure it out as we go. Stick with me, this one's gonna be fun. Okay, so I came into the shop this morning to look at the work I was up late doing last night and I realized I made, I made a pretty bad mistake. So I gotta redo all these lines. This is by far the most challenging layout I've ever done on a piece, hands down. Um, oh geez, um, gotta start erasing some stuff and start over. Okay, so I managed to fix it. I used all the stuff I learned. I'm doing the first half here to transfer it to the bottom. And I used all that from the first half, transferred it over to the second half. You saw me using the calculator. I apologize, I, I'm terrible at math. Uh, I wanna make sure all my lines are symmetrical. I've already got the geometry of the idol pretty much good to go. All right, let's see how it goes. <laughs> Okay, I'm done drawing. I'd say overall it was probably about three hours of drawing and stenciling. Just having trouble with measuring the symmetry and trying to get everything perfect. Anyway, it's done now, so I'm pretty stoked. We're gonna, um, gonna grab the Dremel here, get it engraved it up, get it all carved up so I can see my weld paths clearly. And then uh, once I'm done that, I'm gonna clean it and decontaminate everything and probably regrain it with some sandpaper, get it clean again, and then uh, yeah, we'll start welding. That's it. Two and a half hours of cutting. My hands hurt, but I'm pretty stoked. I got the layout I wanted. I got the symmetry pretty much perfect, exactly like I wanted, and I didn't mess any lines up. So, gotta get this freaking thing off my face. Get out of here. And it's hot in here. It's like 30 degrees. I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit. Probably a million degrees. So sweet. I'm gonna brush it up pretty heavy now. Uh, I'm gonna wipe it super clean. I'm gonna run down all of that. It will be time to weld. Okay, so all 
of the decontamination process is done now. It's clean. I'm nervous. Uh, no matter how many times I do these TIG welding projects, I still get nervous. I'm always, especially the first pass. We got all our little passes X'd out. I got everything numbered uh, so I can literally see which passes are negative space and which passes have weld. We'll see how it goes. Everything was good so far. Pretty stoked to give it a whirl. Wish me luck. Here I go. Okay, there it is. So that was three hours of welding just to do the faces on the sides. So I've got the faces done. I think I'm happy with the eyes, but I'm gonna wait to do all that fancy dot work. And then once I decide I'm happy with the eyes, then I'll probably do the dot work on the eyes then. But so far I'm pretty happy. I had a good groove going there, but I'm stoked. I've been thinking about this one a lot and putting a lot of thought into how I'm gonna do it, which way I'm gonna do it. Um, directions, switching around with different cups because I wanted the color to pop. I even had a little uh, spirit animal floating around in here too. His uh, like flying ant or something just came in through the open window over there. Yeah, that's what you get for living in the forest. Crazy bugs every time you open a window. Man, I really don't know how this one's gonna go. I'm not sure exactly how it's gonna go, but I'm pretty confident with it. We're gonna follow it and see how it goes.
Okay, so there we go. That was, I don't even know how many hours that was. I lost track, but this was days of work. Uh, I would say probably ballpark of actually, since I started welding on the piece, definitely over 15 hours, but I'm really, really happy with it. All the stripe lines and passes I've done so far, turned out really, really good. I had a few mistakes to contend with here and there. I was getting super frustrated in a few spots. Like I'm glad I wasn't filming all of it because you would have caught me swearing. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some photos of it. Uh, I'm gonna take it inside, put it on my iPad so I can use the program on my iPad to do some tapping and kind of work out the next part, which is kind of like my special sauce, my like signature look to my welding pieces where I do a lot of dot work. That's what I'm doing next. Go inside, let's grab a coffee and uh, get organized and we'll come back out and finish it off. Thank you. 